A senior congressional correspondent, Chad Pergram, is on site there to give us a little sense of what's happening. Hi, Chad. Hey there, Martha. This is a massive protest, one of the biggest protests I've ever seen covering Capitol Hill. They have pretty much taken over the Cannon Rotunda here on Capitol Hill. This is in the Cannon House office building across the street from the U.S. Capitol. Hill, Capitol. As you can hear, they are chanting, they are singing. Now, these are mostly people who are Jewish, who are saying, we want to free Gaza. They were chanting just a few moments ago, chants of ceasefire. Jews say, ceasefire now. And also wearing T-shirts that say, let Gaza be be free. This is a massive demonstration here. There's a number of Capitol Police on scene. There have been a few arrests here, and there's a whole cordon of U.S. Capitol Police surrounding them. Uh, we're told that they might move in to try to arrest some of these demonstrators. Security on Capitol Hill around the Capitol itself was very tight today. There was a memo from the House Sergeant at Arms uh, last night uh, indicating to staff that they expected some disruptions and demonstrations today. In fact, they put a small fence up around the Capitol itself. You had to show ID to get through. But they have come over and taken over the entire rotunda of the Cannon House office building. This is probably twice as big as any demonstration that I've ever seen. Martha? All right, Chad, thank you very much. Keep a close eye on that. We'll take you back there with live uh, shots of uh, what's going on in the Capitol throughout the course of the hour. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.